morning and welcome to What's That Guy Doing? Today we're at the Beaver Dam Conservation Area. Okay. The big sign is gone. I don't know where that went. But this is a uh, trail. So let's take it. Let's take a walk. The entrance is right by Beaver Dam Road. So it's loud. Alright, now it's getting better. So uh, we got some white arrows. White diamonds with a black arrow in it. So that must be our trail marker. Very good. This is supposed to be a two mile loop. It runs alongside of a, uh, of a pond. So we'll check it out. So far so good. I like it. Okay, so... If we go right, that would be the trail loop. If we go left, that would be the pond. So, let's go to the pond and check it out. Oh my goodness, this is nice. I don't know what pond this is. All right, we're back on the loop trail. Now all I can think about is fishing that pond. This is just a sign that fell down. I'm kind of holding it on my knee. <laughs> but if you can read it. All right, get back on the trail. So I believe that was the starting point of the actual uh, trail loop. And it's running right alongside the uh, pond we were just at. Oh my goodness, this is cool. Oh yeah. Looks like the water level is down a little bit, just like everywhere. I see all little sorts of little swirls. I even see a frog. This place is alive. We're coming back here to fish, definitely. Oh, I should have stopped for night crawlers. Oh well. Okay, back on the trail.
I see a few little side trails that look like they've been grown over or kind of old. Just don't get confused. bench. And this is what you'll see if you sit on this bench. Nice. All right, I think we're coming to the point where we're going to say goodbye to the uh, to the pond and start moving deeper into the woods to make the loop. Now, I've never been in here before. I thought I had, but um, I haven't. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I haven't anyway. But trails are marked very nicely, even though some of the stuff like the signs uh, are falling down or missing. Very nice trail. Birds are loud. I hope you can hear them. I'll just shut up. See what I mean? Another fallen sign about an Indian pipe flower that's not here right now anyway. So, all right, moving on. Okay, I found out the name of the pond. It's called Little Island Pond, even though I don't see an island on it. Um, I could be wrong, but uh, who knows? I don't know. I just got it off maps. So if it's wrong, it's their fault. <laughs> well, it's not my intention to uh, rate these trails or anything or give you a review. Uh, my intention is just to show you what's out here in case you decide that you want to take a trip yourself out here and walk these trails. I don't think uh, it's something that you should rate. I mean. Getting out in nature, walking around, staying active, that's what it's really all about. And for those who can't, well that's where I come in I guess. But uh, you know, me reaching my 50s and everything, I noticed over the shutdown the more I sat still the more my body ached. So I decided that I was going to just get up and get active. And well, the whole YouTube thing just kind of came along. My son was doing a gaming channel and he looked like he was having fun. So I just decided to buy a hundred dollar GoPro and start doing it myself. And so far it's been pretty fun. Oh, hey, another couple lady slippers. You can see that? There you go. That's a 
always cool to see. There's several out here. Bunch of them. All right, moving on. Okay, we've moved away from the pond and we're much deeper into the woods now. And uh, tons of mosquitoes in here. Remember your deep woods off. And it gives me a chance to remind you to check yourself for ticks when you're done. Because that might not go good. If uh, you miss a tick. All these little whoop de doos be cool for a uh, mountain biker. that there's a few side trails and you know my advice stay on the main trail because suddenly sometimes these side trails can end without warning and suddenly you gotta turn back anyway and you're spending a whole bunch of energy you don't need to spend so my advice stay on the main trail and follow your markers I found another pond and this is a big island pond and it is big and there is an island oh wow yeah I guess we'll be coming back here too it's hard not to pay attention to this stuff this looks like a good swimming hole oh man I wish I didn't have to go to work all right let's get back on the trail all right, I think we're nearing the end of our loop. Yeah, here we are, right where we begin. All right, cool. And this way. It is the parking lot. All right, well, that's pretty much it from Beaver Dam Conservation Area. This was a nice trail. But uh, same with every trail I've noticed. They start off with tons of markers, and then they get more and more sparse until there's just none left. And that's what we ran into here today again. So, just watch out for that. Make sure your markers are clear and follow them. All right, till next time. Have a nice day.